What's up, everybody, and welcome back to Dad and Daughter TCG. I am joined by Cora, as always. What's up? And today we're opening some Core 2020. Uh, as always, you know, quarantine's still kind of a thing in some places. My local store did not have an event, so we picked up two pre-release kits, and they gave us some price support. So we're going to do the same thing uh, that we did for our Ikoria pre-release. But that box video is actually not up yet. So you'll actually see that after this one. And uh, so we're gonna open these, we're gonna open this, and then we're gonna say whoever gets the better promo gets the two, gets the extra cards from these packs in their pool. And then uh, we'll play for fun. Because why not? Because you never know. Sometimes the rares you get are just garbage. And uh, that's just the way it is. Sometimes you get a bad pre-release kit. That's cool. Whoa. Nice. M21. All right, so this, I'm just gonna pull out the promo. So we got a Conspicuous Snoop. That's actually a pretty sweet promo. My last one in the uh, Ikoria video is actually, mine was crimped. I ended up selling it. Uh, so that was pretty fun. And then got some codes and everything else is, well, I guess just lame. Anyways, so we got what? One, two, three, four, five, six packs. I know. I moved it. I keep bumping the camera. Oh, okay. So these are backwards? Just like there? Yeah, just like there. So I'm going to turn these. I'm going to put these right here. All right. Volcanic. Whoa. Volcanic Salvo is our first rare. And I take it most of you guys have probably seen everything else. So we're just going to make ourselves a regular old pile for that. Hope we get some good cards to see what. Oh, <laughs> Sublime Epiphany. I like this card. I think this is actually really interesting. Um, is it kind of like Cryptic Command? Sure. But is it something that's really interesting and standard that does a lot? Yeah, I think that's actually really cool. Oh, I guess I should see if we got any uh, showcase cards, right? I didn't look through that first pack to see if we got any. Didn't know what slot they come in. And I know you can get like a foil like showcase land out of these boosters. Well, there's just a regular one, went to the foil. Alchemist's Gift, so that's our first foil. And Ghostly Pilferer, huh. That's a pretty cool card. I like the artwork on that. Look at him just coming through the wall. So oh, that feels mighty thick. By, like, by comparison to some of the other packs. Oh, well, they did reprint Mind Rot in this set. Uh, okay. Makes sense. Mind Rot's a great draft card. You can get that in the pools. Oh. And just offset someone's day. It's brutal. So the Soldier, Blossoming Sands, and Nine Lives Enchantment, the Cat Nine Lives card. I love cats. So that card's just hilarious to me. Again, the rares feel different than the rest of the cards do. Yeah, I think they make them like stronger because they might be more valuable. Oh. Sometimes they get printed on a different sheet. Tranquil Grove and Temple of Malady. Okay, that's lame. Didn't want that as a rare. Who wants those? I'm not a big fan of temples. At least they're like better tap lands than most. And not just gaining like one life. At least you can scry a little and do something with the fact that it comes in a tap. And Subari, Subira, excuse me. That's a sick card. So that'll be a lot of fun. And then, yeah, this draft kit, I don't know. I don't know how what, what I would have done with it. There's not, in my opinion, there's not a ton of synergy, at least in the rare slot. So you'd be coming down to whatever I've got here. And for a pre-release pack to only get one foil that's pretty interesting so i'm gonna move my extra off here we're gonna put cora's two extra packs right here i'm gonna pop this one open for her it's actually always so hard for me to open that you just gotta get your fingernail underneath it you'll get it over time i think it's easier for me with pokemon yeah the pokemon ones aren't as thick so we're gonna leave that there for you Oh, nice. Stormwing Entity? That's pretty cool. I wonder... 
Yeah, that's pretty cool. Nice. So I think uh, I think we both got evenly spaced promos. Oh, and then here's you can have you can have my arena card. We'll let Cora have hers. And then, boom, six packs. Let's do it. What, did, what color did you get? You got a you got a green. I think sometimes at like nice. well, sometimes when we're at two headed and we get dice and we get like dice that we want to trade, we just do it. Heck yeah, we've traded dice with tons of people for fun. Yeah. Right. Kind of fun. It's nice that these ones are backwards though, because you can just basically show the rare and put everything else down. Oh my gosh! Oh. I tried to say and. Wow! Pack one, Elder Gareth, Gergoth, oh Gergoroth, oh low, low, low. Excuse me, holy crap! This thing is a five cost six six. Vigilance, Trample, and Reach, and whenever it attacks or blocks, you do a bunch of cool stuff. I think that card is absolutely epic. I think you won the pack battles on those, so we're going to have to... I think you're just going to have to go ahead and open those when you're down, too. You got the better kit already. Oh, my first pack. It's usually, like, on... It's usually on the last pack that I win. Yeah. Hey, at least you got, you know, the packs that make sense. Hey, just pull a card, though. You got it. So, sorry if my nails look bad. <laughs> I messed them up today. <laughs> hey, when you're having your kid, you're having fun. Yeah. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Look Whoa. at that. Look at those new basics. That's so Aren't cool. Aren't those sick? I think those look sick. And then you got a ruined halo, dude. You just put that in the token pile. Ruined halo. It's an old reprint. Well, not old, but it's been reprinted a bunch. All right. Jump on to your next pack, kiddo. We're not getting any of those alternate arts in uh, just the regular packs. That's weird. Pre-release packs are tight. And the booster pack ones, the booster box ones are empty, basically. Oh, proceed well? Dope. That's cool. Eight, eight for seven. Such a blue thing to have. In a pre-release, it probably stomps in like the most random ways possible. All right. Next pack, magic. You got what? Two left after this? Yep. Any third pack? Sorry that I keep up with the camera. Going crazy. She's just too excited for 421, 21, guys. I'm way too excited. Nice, an emblem. Those are, for some reason, always hard to come by. Containment Priest. <laughs> Dope. I love that card. It's a great little commander card. Super enjoyable. All right, on to your next ones. Dang. That's a good rare. Yeah, I think you definitely won that uh, pack battle. I don't know why they make the pack stronger in, in like newer sets. I don't know. We're gonna put the value up here and it's only gonna be on the rares. So we'll calculate it, but I'm 99% sure that Cora has beat me out on this one. And she got the Animal Sanctuary. Sick. It's a cool little land card that's specific to the uh, tribal that is animals and dogs and cats. And I love animals. Any type of animal that we get for a pet, I'm going to be happy. There you go. Another night token. How many of those do we need? We have a foil unicorn. So we both got one foil. Okay. So maybe they toned down the foils. And then you got a temple. Temples for me. Temples for you. Temples for everybody. Oh, look. Look. We did get one in that. Oh, that's super cool. That's cool looking. Yeah. All right. Well, you won. So why did I just, I'll have you open these two. Why did I just speak like that? <laughs> I don't know. I ask myself that question every day. You'll have you open those two. I'm going to open these two. I'll wait for you to be done. Let's just crack into these and see what we got, huh? Oh, sick. Mangara the Diplomat. I'm off to the side. I'm going to move on. Here. So that was actually pretty slick. What else did we get? What? See? Nothing Why? great. Why did you hear you so crazy? 
All right, let's get into this one. Those packs are considerably looser than the pre-release packs are. Tranquil Grove. Ooh, foil. Warden of the Woods. It's a cool art. And, oh, wait, what? How do you even say that? I'm just going to call him Spidey Boy, since he's a spiteful boy. Get those <laughs> out of the way. Spite Boy. He's a little spite guy. He's a little sad. You sad guy. How many printings of op do we need in the world? Oh my gosh. All right, Cora, you're up. Last two packs. We'll get it. And then we're gonna open up this booster box and see what we get. These are actually way easier to open than the pre-release. Yeah, for sure. the pre-releases are like sealed super tight. The zombie one, the zombie token creeps me out. It is pretty nuts. Oh, sick. That's a cool foil forest. I like that. Primal Might. Huh, that seems like a pretty interesting card. Probably good in limited. I don't know how good that is in actual play. We'll find out as the sets come out. All right, last pack. Let's see if our prize support gives us something magically crazy. What if you pulled an Ugin and Spirit Dragon, get a big boy card, or a big boy to fairy? Oh, uh, hey, well, at least we got the Thieves Guild Enforcer. It's a cool looking mm -hmm. card. Look at the art on that. Oh, who drew that? That's sick. Yeah, that's a <laughs> lot of fun. Well, so I was looking through my cards and I found such a funny common. <laughs> you got a cute little kitty cat. That's funny. Now these, I don't know if you look, we just opened this card though. It's, I feel like it's got a different glare on the back. It's almost glossy. I think they've changed how they make the cards. I wouldn't think so. Yeah, but they definitely have a glossy feel to them, huh? Well, at any rate, thank you guys so much for watching. Let us know who you think got the better pack, me or Cora, but I'm 99% uh, sure Cora got the better pack out of that one. Um, I don't know. I think the Goblin here is a really good hit but i'm gonna add them up put them on screen we'll find out for sure i think she won but you let me know don't remember oh what am i doing don't remember don't forget to like and subscribe and let us know what you guys think in those comments down below and we will see you guys next time